With the current reduced oil price and concerns that it may reduce further or remain at low levels for several years, we'd like to ask, what is your company doing to maintain revenue and production? We believe that it's critical that oil companies optimize their existing wells, thereby reducing lift costs and improving profitability. And in the next few minutes, you'll understand why there's a real opportunity to substantially increase your production. Hello, I'm Sandy Williams from Artificial Lift Performance, and we've been helping oil companies optimize oil production and master artificial lift for over 10 years. If you're using the most expensive artificial lift method, ESPs, we know that it's vital that as well as getting maximum run life from your ESP, you actually get all the oil that the ESP should and can produce. Let's face it, an ESP may cost you anywhere from $200,000 to $750,000, depending on what part of the world you're in. And if you're paying that kind of money, you want to ensure you're getting maximum return on your investment. That's why we have developed a software tool that allows you to have an up-to-date understanding of the actual performance of your ESP, recognize production increase opportunities, and diagnose lost oil production. Without constantly having the right data and interpretation, it's impossible to make informed decisions. And it's also vital to instantly appreciate the financial gain of taking immediate action and the implications of delay. This graph shows the annual revenue losses for a well where the ESP is not working properly or the well is not optimized, resulting in a daily oil loss. Assuming an oil price of $60 per barrel, failing to produce 100 barrels of oil per day loses you $2.19 million, or $21.9 million if you're losing 1,000 barrels of oil per day. Just recently in Colombia, we identified a well that had been limping along at 500 barrels of fluid per day. The operator acted on our advice and changed out the ESP, realizing the additional production and a staggering 821 barrels of oil extra per day. The operator had lost more than $15 million in the seven months that the problem had not been diagnosed. How many ESP wells do you have that have production increase opportunities or an undiagnosed ESP problem causing lost production? In our work all over the world, we typically see that operators have opportunities in about 30% of their ESP produced wells. Results like these just cannot be ignored, and we'd like to help you find these opportunities. Now, you don't have to take our word for this. If you contact us, we'll happily put you in touch with those we've worked with, and they can tell you for themselves the impact we've been able to make. The solution lies in software that we can provide you with.